I'm Trooper Delvin. I'm with Trooper Bob, no patrol. What do officers face in decision making when it comes to traffic stops? Law enforcement officers make difficult split second decisions every day. What's the legal reason for the stop? What violations and what actions to take? Where's the vehicle going to pull over? What things to consider? Officer safety along with the safety of the violator and the surrounding public. The driver's mind is also thinking, what did I do wrong? Who is pulling me over? Am I going to get a ticket? The officer's mind is also thinking, this is an unknown person, don't know the reason or intentions for the stop, what movements they will make. What should an individual do when he or she is stopped by an officer? Consider the officer's safety. Pull into a well-lit area well off the roadway if possible. Keep your hands on the steering wheel, and if it's dark, consider turning on your interior lights. If you have tinted windows, please roll them down. Refrain from making any sudden excessive movements in the vehicle. Stay calm. The officer will approach and ask for your appropriate documents. Ma'am, you may see driver's license, registration, proof of insurance, please. Thank you. If you have a concealed weapon on you, please present the permit at the time that you present your license to the officer. The officer should state the reason for the traffic stop. If not, it's okay to ask. If you don't agree with the officer's enforcement actions, please wait for the court date to make your point. Avoid arguments on the side of the road. If you feel you've been mistreated, wait and report it afterwards to an agency supervisor. Your encounter may have been recorded on the officer's in-car video system or body camera. It's all about communication and understanding. By law enforcement communities working together, we can have a safe environment for everyone. Thank you for watching.